are you looking for opportunities in the US, specifically looking for master's opportunities or PhD opportunities? This video then is for you. Today I'm going to introduce you to this website, the job board, the natural resource job board website by the Texas AM University. On this job board, you can find various um, opportunities for masters and PhD, ranging from uh, fields including range life, wildlife, fisheries, aquaculture, natural resources, amongst others. On this website or this job board, they, they post, they update periodically or almost every day assistantships or job opportunities that exist in this domain. And this also covers not only US but also Canada. And so if you want to find masters or PAD assistantships, this is also a place to look for, especially if you are uh, studying or interested in studying a course within this domain. So let's go and look at how the job board looks like. So before we continue, this is my um, YouTube page where I post about scholarship, study abroad and work abroad opportunities. Currently, I have several videos that uh, have various scholarships and uh, studying in Germany, the Netherlands and the US, also including MasterCard Foundation Scholarship, also moving to the US, scholarships in Australia, amongst others. So you should check them out. If you are new here as well, I wish that you hit on the subscribe button so that anytime I drop a video, you are one of the first people to see it and watch the video. So to begin with, this is how the job board looks like. Um, this is where you do the search. You can filter as well, which we'll do very soon. But currently there are about 1,176 jobs that are put there, ranging from jobs all over uh, US and Canada. Uh, we can look at them uh, soon. But for this video sake, we are looking at uh, master's assistantships or master's opportunities and PAD opportunities in the US and Canada. So in order to do that, we need to filter. So we first go to job type and then we filter for uh, graduate opportunities. Th this graduate opportunity means you are looking for master's and PhD. So whether you want master's or you want PhD, this is where you look at that. We could also look at the undergraduate opportunities, but that can be done very later. Uh, in terms of location, you can also click and then put where you want it to be, but we'll leave that one open so that we can have more uh, opportunities. So after looking, after filtering to the graduate opportunities, see the number reduced to 359. But to be more specific, why don't we just filter for masters? So let's start with masters. So if we put masters here and we search or master, then we get a further filtering to see the number of masters programs that are available. So now if we look here, see the first one is master of science in ecology or master, master in environmental management at Western Colorado University. And this is how it is. They put the website here. The details are found here. The deadline for applying for this position is the 15th of January. Because it's in the US, the month comes first before the day. So this is 15th January 2025. And this was published on the 27th, 24th of July. So quite some time now. And you need to be prepared to start by 1st August in 2025. So this is how it is. The detail is found here. We offer multiple pathways, including residential and thesis based, master of science in ecology or hybrid with environmental uh, management. So this is how the full detail you can read about this. It said employees offer a limited number of competitive assistantships available to US citizens or permanent residents funded by this. So these people are giving their assistantships to US citizens and permanent residents. But um, as an international student, you could also uh, email this, see if it is open for international students. And sometimes it's open and you'll be able to apply. So this is just one of them. Let's look at the other ones. This is a postdoc, uh, but this is also an MS in Bumblebee Ecology Niche Modeling and Conservation. So this is also something you can look at. Um, 
application is 30 application deadline is 31st october and you apply through this and they tell you what to uh, submit cv personal statement and all that and then you can contact the advisor who is this person and their email is here so if you need any information you can email them here and that is how it is done there's also one here which is not uh which is still open they are actually looking for two ms teaching assistantships marine and environmental biology and the deadline is 18th november so it's still open and these are the two projects project one project two let's look at the um you need a bachelor's you need gra and other things so these are how to do it but if you open the website sometimes they waive the gra so you have to check the website to see if there is a way that they waive the GRA is something that you can get. So this is the advisor, the name of the advisor and their email. If you want to email them, this is another opportunity. There's also one here, Master of Environmental Degree, which is similar to the other one that we found. Um, so this is also Fish Ecology Master's Position. It's a position, um, so you need um, you need to have a bachelor's in biology and other things you can read about that they, they give you a stipend of about 2625 per month and it's in fall if you're interested you email this professor they said the gra scores that is if available but not required so here the gra is not required and please put this position in your subject title and then with all the information so you need your letter of interest uh, curriculum vita cv unofficial transcripts contact information for three professional referees your know, ask if this is available um and other things relevant writing samples so you email it to the professor and you may be lucky to get it so this is how that one is um, there's also masters in uh, environmental education and science communication this is also available you can look at all the things that are available um, so currently they are not accepting international students so you have to read for more details um, there's other ones to check out for we can move to the next page master of science modeling gray fox uh, master ms in biology there's also one in biology you can look through this is an opportunity this is also a master's student recruitment at the University of Texas at Tyler. Yeah, this is also open. You can look at this. There's one here as well. So there are so many of them on the job board. And one interesting thing is that they keep updating this job board. So if you you find their website, you can always look at them to see um, which one you are interested in. So now if you want a PhD, we can filter it for PhD. So we look for PhD and then we search. We search for PhD. So you, this is a PhD opportunity. Um, PhD opportunity by Dr. Mark Boyce. And this is actually in the Canada. This is not even in the US. This is Canada. So you can look at it. And the deadline is 31st December. So there's still time. And it's PhD in... Uh, sheep disease ecology that's big horn sheep um, disease ecology if you are doing research in that you, you should have an msc in ecology uh, it meets the requirements if uh, preference will be given to domestic canadian african but international students with strong qualification will be considered as well so international students will be considered if you are interested yeah uh, if you're interested you should contact this the professor with this email with your cv and an expression of interest in the project so if you want to see more about the project you read about here they said project description so there's more to read about the project description you can also go to the the link itself and then read more about it so that's one opportunity there's pad position in environmental data science also here uh, temple university states and in the u.s and you can look at all this and they also well the deadline is passed but you can yeah for this one the deadline is passed 
so you can keep looking there are so many of them so this is the pad ones they are like we looked at the master's one there's pad one as well look at this pad in soil bio geochemistry so you can look at all the, the projects if you want more information you click on this or the link and then you can find that um yeah so and amongst others so this is a very good link that you can keep for yourself if you want to find these assistantships and they are pretty for they, they spell out everything that you need you see what you need um how much you are going to pay you and all that so if you email the professor uh expressing your interest and also with your documents then they can then they can then tell you what further things to do to be able to secure everything fully so this is how it is done uh, we can look at one of them the one in canada we can look at the project so if we click on the link so this is how his link looks like his private link you can look at that this is how the project is there the boys lab is looking for phd student to work on this for winter 2025 so this is a project description, additional project information, your requirements and everything. So the, he gives you more information on his website. And if you if you want to email him and that's how come and how you can secure it. If you want maybe his let's check if his email has further opportunities. So if you click on opportunities, I think currently that's the only opportunity he has. So shoot your shots if you are interested in this particular research then you might be very lucky so let's go back to the job board to see the others so this is back to the job board we can look at several of them we can go to the third page to see if they have things that are interested interesting look at this one forest university of alabama forest ecology and management and the deadline is 14th march 2025 so this is still some time um and one thing about the us is that if you even if you have a bachelor's sometimes you can try to get a direct phd so so here they said applicants will be evaluated based on the academic record recommendation letters and prior experience so this is how it is if you have a strong bachelor degree with some experience you can try this as well because in the us sometimes they give you they give you the opportunity to uh, have a direct phd so in that case you be, you do a master's and then a phd and if you look at the requirements here they say that you only require a bachelor's so they didn't even put master's so if you have a bachelor's and you feel like you want to do a phd then it is a master's plus phd so you apply uh, for this position and then you can get a direct master's to PhD So if you want to see the posting we can click on the link to see further information on it So this is how the link looks like forest dynamic lab. They have put everything there um, So in terms of their research This is what they do who are the people their publications to join them maybe they write uh, we encourage inquiries from prospective graduate students with research interest and apply this in particular we seek students with a passion of for forest science and so we offer our program offers msc and PAD opportunities so if you are interested you, these are competitively awarded to express interest contact us and please include a cv and resume an official transcript most important explain why you want to join our lab so if you want to um, join their lab you like their research then you contact them with the relevant uh, document if you want to know more about their research you click on the research you can find more about their research you check the people who are there the people who are there you can go to their they are, yeah this is the person the head of the lead director so that's his email that you contact um you can read about their work on google scholar and other things and if you like their work you can mention who you really want to work with these are people who have worked with them previously and it's cool so try it 
try it if you're interested and it's and i hope that you can do it let's go back to the job board so the job board is here you can filter you can filter to go through those who actually want um, masters like i said you can put in the masters go through there are so many of them that i can't show everything in this video but i know that you'll be able to go through them so i'll put the link in the description below um so that you can go through them for yourself bear in mind that this website is updated all the time so if you watch once you have to keep looking at the job board to see the courses that you are interested in 